There's plenty of monsters out there. But I think we're relatively safe where we are. They're in Ravine, so that's their little height. All right, in our chest, where we can unload our other stuff. Also, a furnace. A lot of splashing around. Make this place light up. And what we will do is. Uh, put the iron in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> I knew that. Okay. We're going to put a good chunk of our coal in here. Gonna put some wood in there. Put that. Some extra stone. You know what I kind of feel like doing? Going in at first to see if there's diamonds. Hmm. Yes. Well, I feel like making some sort of tunnel to the surface over here. Hmm. The question is, a stairway or a ladder? What would be a better idea in this context? I take a stairway. Then I get there's a side of the forest. There might be a forest. Let's see. Uh, I'll make another door. Because I want to make a more direct access way to this area. Alright. And I feel so happy with my recent discovery of iron that I'm going to use some of it to dig this passageway. Hopefully nobody sees that it's wasteful. Yeah, I think it should be a staircase, not um... Not a, um... Because that would be a wood resource. Yes. I'm not even sure if I have enough wood on me at the moment. Alright. At every... Like I did with the other staircase I made before, at every even number, or every, you know, multiple of ten, we are going to make a 90 degree turn and continue in a different direction. I don't know, I just started doing that with these long shafts. It actually seems like a good idea, so that way it doesn't Go down. Yes, indeed. And also there's the possibility of producing more um, more tunnels branching off the side at a later date if, if desired. Alright, 34. There's a possibility we might break into one of the um, places that we were already in. One, two, three, four. One, two. All right, we're at 40. So that means we are going to make a turn back to the right here. It's going to sort of zigzag its way up. I always find that when making stairways, I always make each space four high because that is how much room you need to not bonk your head when you're going up the stairs. I wonder how close to the house we are going to pop out. I just saw the front uh, end time. What do you say? It might be night time when you come out so keep that in mind. 
Oh, uh, you're uh, you're right about that. Maybe that's another reason I should make that watch. Because <laughs> won't that tell you whether it's day or night outside? Alright, only one more up and then we're making another turn. Oh, there goes that shovel. Alright, so... 50, we are turning to the left and continuing. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh oh. Guess where we are? We're underwater. Uh. All right. I want to see where we pop out. It is nighttime. Oh wow. I think the sun's rising or setting. Yeah, I think uh, it's rising. Alright. So judging by this, we want to go in that direction. Would be nice. So we're gonna swim back down here. It's funny when you're making stairwells and come up underwater. Um Pretty much every uh, everything downward is flooded. All right, so we wanted to go left, didn't we? Yeah. I think we'll just make a straight passageway to the left for I don't know, ten, twelve squares, something like that. Okay, that was a creepy sound. So we're going to do that. We're going to one, two, three, four. Hit up. Oh, not yet, not yet. Got to go forward a little bit more still, I guess. We are not yet ready for the surface. Damn it. Yeah. All right. Now I think we are. Hope anyway. No, we are not. Jeez. I'm still gonna swim up here to see where we are. Swim faster. Hey, chickens. All right. Actually, what I wanted to do is go back a few blocks and turn left. I think it's right here I want to go up. Alright. Wait. Ah. Oh, sigh. Okay, here we go. May we finally be able to go up in peace now. The answer appears to be yes. Might be breaking surface now. Ah, damn it. Okay. 
Well, at least we know we just have to go right a little bit. And then we've got it. We got in 60. Okay, good. Oh, there we go. I hit my torch again. I keep doing that for some reason. Alright. Damn it. Will not leave us alone, but you know what? We're close enough. We're doing this. You're not going to let Mother Nature control you. Yes, Mother Nature ain't got shit on me. Alright. Whoa. This is precarious, slightly. Uh, <laughs> no, wrong spot. Oh, this is a fail. Eh. Now I just have to remove this source block. Yes. I think we have finally... Whew. What a relief. And now to find out where we are. You know, after being underground so long, it's very refreshing to see the, um, the day side of the world, you know? Only to find that you'll have to go back underground, so, right? Yes, have to go back underground, but... Alright, I don't have any idea where any of this is. Hey, chicken. But we can't be too far away from the original area. Oh, there's a lot of eggs. A lot of what? There's a lot of eggs. I want to take those eggs. I did. Oh, there's more over there. Wow, these are egg generating machines here. This might be a good place for a chicken farm at some point. Very scenic chicken farm at that. I wonder if this is part of the same epic mountains biome as before. I think it's. Yeah, it definitely is. Hmm. I have a feeling maybe it's on the other side of this that we're going to. But I shouldn't go too far away without making some sort of marker. Or at least a you should probably make a cottage. And then you got the option of returning to the underground or walking. Yes. Where exactly did I come up from the water, though? It was on the other side of this mountain. Like, Oh, here it is. All right, good. So, I think it might be time to make the actually make the stairs, and then I'll make the stairs all the way up the hill to the cottage. Oh, man, I'm already, already working on projects that are quite possibly way too big. But hey, the iron has finished smelting. So we're going to put that in here. We are going to make some stairs. Alright, a complete set of 64 stairs. That should be enough.
I still think the quest for diamonds is paramount. Although animal breeding is something else that is, I think, is a desirable goal. All right. We will attempt to conquer this mountain. The stairs. Hmm. Let's instead make a turn right here. Oh, there goes my shovel. This reminds me of the very first area of smoothie that I made. Oh, damn it. Wrong things. In terms of, you know, the the stone passage the stone things going up and down the hills. On on uh, what could conceivably pass for a mountain biome back in the pre 1.8 days. I'm too lazy to craft another one. Just gonna break things with my hand. And, aha! I decree that this will be the location of the, uh, of the cabin. Of the what? The cabin will be here. And I can't come home too soon because the sun is setting. Once you have two chickens, you'll, you'll be able to start a farm. Yes. I will make it out of stone. A stone cabin. Too bad there's not many trees right here. Oh, I gotta hurry. Huh. <laughs> Can do disturbing things with animals. And by that I mean make their kids parents. Well, it. Oh, you can. Uh, oh, you can have incest. Yes, because it doesn't really keep track of who is who and everything. And unfortunately, this cabin will not have a bed either, due to our rather extreme wood That's shortage. Bad business. So I believe this is the third house I've built in this world so far, not including the underground house. How high up are you? 86. I'm out of stone, really? How am I out of stone? I don't know. Let's go get some. Hmm. Or it might be better, better to weed down in the bottom. Hmm. There we go. Well, at any rate, I think that's actually a good place to uh, end this recording session. And it uh, and begin another one soon. So... Thanks for watching, everyone, and thank you, uh, Lars, for joining for joining no me problem. here. Um.
thanks for having me on, and yeah, good episode. Yes. Hopefully there will be more soon. So, goodbye everybody.